Hello there guys, it's me Unstable Voltage. Welcome back to episode 10 of Warcraft 3. Unfortunately, I still haven't been able to find a way to record the cinematics very well. It's mainly because this game is so old that the CGI videos actually use a redundant codec that modern operating systems don't support. I am able to get the cinematics to play back, but the colours still washed out and they're very distorted and they have a lot of uh, digital artefacts on them. So I'm going to give it another go over the weekend to see if I can get the cinematics working. Luckily, a lot of the things like the interludes are actually done with the in-game engine, so they do record okay. So, so far, there's only sort of three cinematics in total that we've missed out, which was the actual game's intro, the cinematic to the uh, orc prologue and the cinematic to the human campaign so we, ha we haven't missed too many out at the moment uh, so let's go in and start chapter six which is the culling hopefully we don't have any crashing issues this time around we're going up to Strathholm now something that's very much um one of the uh, dungeons that you can do in World of Warcraft. The actual culling of Strathholm is, uh, well, not in the original Strathholm. Strathholm was very different when World of Warcraft first came out. Uh, but then I think it was after Wrath of the Lich King when they added the whole Caverns of Time thing. And there was the uh, the Strathholm was basically going back in time and doing this, uh, the exact mission, the culling of Strathholm. Glad you could make it, Uther. Watch your tone with me, boy. You may be the prince, but I'm still your superior as a paladin. As if I could forget. Listen, Uther. There's something about the plague you should know. Oh no. We're too late. These people have all been infected. They may look fine now, but it's just a matter of time before they turn into the undead. What? This entire city must be purged. How can you even consider that? There's got to be some other way. Damn it, Uther. As your future king, I order you to purge this city. You are not my king yet, boy. Nor would I obey that command even if you were. Then I must consider this an act of treason. Treason? Have you lost your mind, Arthas? Have I? Lord Uther. By my right of succession and the sovereignty of my crown, I hereby relieve you of your command and suspend your paladins from service. Arthas, you can't just... It's done! Those of you who have the will to save this land, follow me. The rest of you, get out of my sight. Well... You've just crossed a terrible threshold, Arthas. Jaina? I'm sorry, Arthas. I can't watch you do this. Right, so we have a base. Um, we've got a gold mine. Let's go ahead and get... So we've already got enough guys there. Let's go and get a couple more anyway. Um, what units do we have? We've got these guys as well. Uh, do we? Of course. Yes, we have knights. Powerful mounted warriors can learn animal war training. Uh, let's make sure we've got a lumber mill. Let's go and make sure we get the improved masonry. Um, we have a barracks. We've got ourselves some housing. We're probably going to need to get some more um, towers to help us out here. We can upgrade to a keep. It's quite a bit of golden wood, but it's probably worth doing. Uh, let's make sure we get some units out. We'll get a couple of footmen if we can afford them. And we'll go and get that there. So, what is our actual uh, mission? So, destroy plagued villager houses. Kill 100 zombies and stop Malganis from claiming 100 zombies. So I guess we're going to have to go and get out here quite quickly. Uh, let's go and try and get ourselves another um, tower over here. Uh, we've already completed this scout tower. Let's make sure that we get that upgraded as quickly as possible. And let's go ahead and get another scout tower here in the middle. I really want to try and stop anyone from getting in. Let's go and group these guys together. We might as well start to head out and see if we can find anything. 
I want you uh, down here, really. There's a sheep. Can we make it explode? I'm spamming it. Probably not an efficient use of my time. But there we go. Doesn't damage the buildings, does it? No, good. Okay. So you've built this one. Let's go ahead and get you to build another one over um, here, sort of in the middle. And we will upgrade that one. And we will upgrade this one. And what else do we want you to build? We will need a... Um, can't get the arcane sentiment because we haven't got the keep. We don't have a blacksmith's yet. So, oh, we can't get the blacksmith. Okay, let's go back and see what we can do with you. So, we've got, what is that? Is that a, is that a shop? Oh, that's somewhere we can heal up. Well, we don't need to do that just yet. So, let's go in and start getting some of these buildings done. I feel that is something that we shouldn't spend, you know, we shouldn't mess around for too long. We should definitely try and, uh, of course. Make a start on this. So it looks like we need to go and destroy some houses. And the, the quicker we do it, the better, I suppose. Now, what happens when we destroy the houses? Do we have anyone to attack? Yes, we do. There are plague, plagued villagers. So he's pretty much going to be doing the same thing. As you can see, your people are now mine. I will now turn this city household by household until the flame of life has been snuffed out forever. I won't allow it, Malganus. Better that these people die by my hand than serve as your slaves in death. Is there danger? So we've got these guys that we need to kill. And we need to start killing these things off as quickly as possible. We also need to start getting units out where we can. Let's go and get that built. Let's make sure we uh, keep taking out these villagers as quickly as we can. Actually, yeah, there's actually a little um, time period where they're quite easy to take. Can we actually take Malganis out here? Looks like we can possibly deal a bit of a blow to him. Malganis isn't dead yet, but his health is going down. There we go, I can heal a little bit. Is he going to drop? Well, he's down for the time being. So we did lose a few units there, which was unfortunate. Let's get these guys to get down there as well. Um, we would like still to get the... Um, well, the Arcane Sanctum, actually, would be slightly more useful. Uh, so let's get you guys uh, ready. You're, you're, you're sleeping, which is not good. So we'll have to um, use Arthas himself. Not too sure if and when and how Malganis will respawn. I'm not sure how long it will take these guys to... Um, what do you need? Sort of get back into uh, right. a position where we can use them. Where well, one of them's already woken up. I stand for so hopefully this won't take too long. There we go. We want to go and attack these villagers. We do have to sort of manually target them, unfortunately. So let's go and uh, do this. So again, everybody, you're all group one. You're all supposed to be up here doing this. So Malganis doesn't get revived for another two minutes. So we've got a little bit of a um, spare bit of time here. And again, let's make sure we're attacking everybody. There's no point attacking the ground. Because the villagers, um, until they're turned, don't actually count as enemies, it looks like. There we go, you're going to go down. Uh, let's make sure that we still get some more guys coming out here. There we go, we got them all. So, come on guys, let's get you moving. Let's take these houses out down here. So we only have to beat him to 100. 
still got a little bit of time before he comes back to life. And we know that we can sort of go and take him out um, more quickly. I've sent some units down to deal with these ones separately. We'll have a separate little um, little army to do that one, I think. So again, it's just a matter of... Uh, oh, it didn't quite click where I wanted it to click. There's one there that kind of managed to uh, get away with that a little bit. Okay, let's go and do this one over here. Do we have some units? You've built that. Let's go ahead and make sure we get a uh, priest. Work on that. Research magic sentry. Provides human towers with the ability to detect invisible units. That could be useful. Um, we do need a spare um, peasant. Let's go ahead and get you to work on these. Oh, we're actually being attacked up top here. That's not something I was expecting. Luckily, we do have these, uh, these towers up here, so that's not too bad. Um, let's make sure you can come down here and uh, repair that. Uh, you're dealing with all this here. Right. Now, let's go down, and I don't know how easy it is to get to these uh, houses. So, I'm just going to tell you to head there. I guess you're going to head all the way around. So, we might want to go up and deal with... Um, these ones that are up here first. Job's done. Of course. So Assembly let's let's plan. go and do let's go and do the top ones. Certainly. Research complete. Now there's a merchant here. For honor. Um. Oh, it looks like he's actually attacking up the top there. In that case, then let's go and work on the ones to the south. Sound plan. So we'll keep getting out some more units if we can. We do need to get ourselves some more um, houses or farms or whatever they're called. You can do another one as well. Let's keep these guys around just in case we do need to uh, to help. Let's get you over here as well. Number one, right. Let's not hang around because he's going to be quite quick. We are already winning. Right, number one. I've got you all selected. There we go. It's not working for some reason. There we go. Just try and do all these ones down here as quickly as we can. Come on, guys. Get down there. Um, let's go and get ourselves um, a couple of priests. Let's make sure we've got some more of these guys coming. Uh, we will need to get ourselves a uh, blacksmith. So let's go ahead and do that. Work on you guys. Come on, kill them off quick. This would probably be a lot quicker if we had some mortar teams. Let's go and work on this. We've got somebody that's not at full health. Let's make sure we try and keep everybody at full health. So it looks like there's probably a few um, undead uh, bases around as well. Come on, guys. It's so hard to actually click on what you want them to click on sometimes. Now, they might, might try and attack up top, but I'm just basically going to try and race them to the finish here. You are past redemption. Certainly. Justice Come on, I'm clicking on bad guy on uh, villagers. Got them all. Okay, let's go and work on this one. In the meantime, um, let's actually grab you. Uh, you can go and join up with them. Uh, we did get a few more guys out here. Priest, you can go down there and help them. You can hang out with these guys. Let's get a group of four of you with a with a priest. And you guys are going to go down here. You're going to be group two. Group number one. See, I was kind of not really paying attention to what was going on up here. And now we've actually let the undead uh, turn. So this is group one still. Okay, we've got more houses down here. So let's just keep going. For my father, the king. We're still ahead, but only by 15. Betrayer of the light. Justice Our forces are under attack. For my father. Right, we're being attacked up here, which is annoying. Um, 
We do have some units up there. We are going to need some more. I think they should be all right on their own, actually, if I'm perfectly honest. So I'm not too concerned about that. Let's keep getting these houses down then. You guys, group two. I want you down here. Don't know how you, you're going to get to there, but we shall carry on. Looks like those units have all uh, died off anyway. No, 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 no. Come, come back here. I'm here to help. Go and do that. I wasn't trying to tell you guys to move. I was trying to move the map. Um, we want you to go and... Well, you don't even need to repair that. We'll just put you on auto repair anyway. Right, number one. Guys, kill stuff. So we need some more farms. Well, building more farms is not a problem. Uh, we do have some guys spare, so let's go ahead and work on that. I do. I stand for the light. Uh, looks like we're running out of uh, area to uh, attack down here. You, know, you should be attacking that one. You guys, number two, you should be attacking down here. Right. So we've got two groups uh, on this now. Betrayer of the light. Of course. Justice has come. Only one there that we missed by getting quickly. For honor. Another house to attack down here. Is someone injured? By the power of the light, burn. I just attack ground here because then the priest will actually keep uh, healing them up. Feel my wrath. Forces are under attack. For my father, the king. What are we under attack by? Oh, we under attack. All oh, right, he's heading south. My priest's getting wrecked. Unfortunately. A sound plan. Certainly. Of course. Ready for action. So there is a rather large group heading our way, which is unfortunate. Yes, my friend. Uh, let's keep you guys working on this. I think it did help slowing Malganis down right at the beginning. But I mean, obviously, he is catching up now. Yeah, we knew this was happening. Again, I wasn't really paying attention to what was going on. Let's just again ground attack, because then they'll focus on the, um, the targets. Once they've turned into undead and they're no longer neutral mobs, ground attack will actually work. Right, so now we need to get over the bridge to these houses here. my friend. So again, we've got more houses to work on. The light is my strength. I think this mission should be relatively easily doable. Unless there's like a second part. I haven't even seen like a sort of a secondary uh, thing on this one. So again, kill the villagers. Now feel my wrath. They're not quite as quick with the killing when uh, Arthas isn't with them. Already up to 83. Don't know where the rest of his forces are, but we should be okay. So attack that one. It is mainly going to be down to Arthas' uh, little army that's down here. here. Right, here they come. Here's their uh, attack force up top. So we probably need to try and take as many of these down as possible. And let's try and keep everybody healed if we can. Yeah, I'm kind of aware. Oh, we lost one. We are struggling taking some of these down there. Oh, they're eating the um, corpses down there. Just make sure we get rid of all of them as much as possible. Right, these guys are going to carry on working down here. We're nearly done up here anyway. Yeah, don't let them eat the corpses. Just kill them all off. 94 to 46. In fact, do these guys actually count for us when we kill them? 
No. But we're very, very nearly done here. This might be one of the quickest missions that I've done in a while. Okay, there is another house down there that you can work on. 99. 100. Is that the mission finished? We're going to finish this right now, Malganus. Just you and me. Brave words. Unfortunately for you, it won't end here. Your journey has just begun, young prince. Gather your forces and meet me in the Arctic land of Northrend. It is there that we shall settle the score between us. It is there that your true destiny will unfold. I'll hunt you to the ends of the earth if I have to. Do you hear me? To the ends of the earth! Now, I don't like picking holes in stories, but how can you hunt me to the ends of the earth when we're not on earth, we're on Azeroth? And how can I meet you in the Arctic lands of Northrend when the Arctic is something I've never heard of? You're in the Northrend lands of Northrend. Well, that was a nice sort of 20 minute mission there. Uh, obviously, I didn't really find any secrets, although the map does kind of start fully uncovered. There probably are secrets on that map that I missed. And again, what I'm just trying to do is concentrate on the mission objectives. I'm not trying to get cocky and always go and try and just destroy um, the enemy camp. So, like I said, I'm, I'm the, the main reason that I want to play through this game and the expansion is because I haven't played through them before. And I, I want to absorb the lore and the story, so I'm not too bothered about the journey in getting there. I'm not necessarily trying to 100% it and find all the secrets and everything. I just want to be able to play through the quests and actually see the story as we go. But I'm quite happy with that mission, so I will see you guys on the next video. And until then, goodbye for now.